get off my case, all right? <sighs> to be honest, you'd know if I was on your case. I'm just saying that when we finish the accounts, we've got to produce an action plan. I know we're getting it. Yeah, not just an action plan. We need to... I guess it's Aiden. Connor. Yeah. Would you like me to get you and Mr Connor a milky coffee from us? Uh, no, you all right, Sal? Thanks. Oh, OK. Sally, you know that diary you love so much. You did notice it was bank holiday today, didn't you? Yeah, I, well, I just thought I'd catch up on some spreadsheets for an hour. It's so much easier when the machine is aren't in. I mean, you must find that. Really, there's no need. Yeah, but if Sally's offering. Well, ah, it's your boyfriend. Why don't you spend the day with him, you know? Relax a little, come back tomorrow. Well, are you sure you can manage? Well, you know, yeah. Tim? Oh, Mr Connor, this is my partner, Tim. All right, well, you're a window cleaner, right? He's a window enhancement executive. So if you want your windows... Enhancing? I'm your man. You're not working today, are you? No, she's not. Good, cos Sophie wants you to go into town, get some balloons or something. Oh, yes, yeah, Sophie's my daughter and she's organising a charity event in the bistro later. It's a fundraising auction. It's for Maddie. So? Fancy bringing your wallets? Ah, uh, we're tied up in this place. Well, cheers, anyway. Oh, yeah, Tim's working too. That is one of the drawbacks, you know, of running your own business. Yeah, well, there's a sign county top up for grabs if you're interested. Seriously? Yeah. Well, maybe we should drop by. Well, you know, only if you're not too busy. Yeah, more the better, yeah? We should go. See you later. Right, well, this executive's got to go and wash a few windows. Hey, you can be the one to tell Sophie about Carla. Sweetheart, what hurt? Yeah. We're just going to take a picture of your tummy, that's all. And then as soon as it's over, I promise you can have something really nice to eat, yeah? Oh, yeah, we'll get you a big treat. Anything you want, OK? OK, chocolate. <gasps> chocolate? Mm. Chocolate? Chicken. <sighs> you know, Jace can hardly lift his head off the pillow, yet he still fusses about what pyjamas he'll wear. Trying to impress the nurses, I expect. <laughs> Seriously, though, give him my love. So, what's your plans? Ah, uh, well, actually, I was uh, wondering if you might want me to stick around, because you hate an empty house. I wasn't born yesterday. Do you mind? Won't be for long. Just till Jason's home. Me and Lloyd splitting up. I know it was all my fault. But this thing with him and Liz, it's really not the stuff it now with me. Sorry, I, I know Jason. I know what you meant. I can't take sides. I don't expect you to. Because they're two of my oldest friends. Aline, I know. All right. Just tell me a lad's back, OK? Thank you. Oh. He'll be fine, you know. <sighs> oh, there you are. <laughs> uh, Steve told me you know about you. Telling Andrea. Liz, I am. Um... Lloyd, it's fine. It's just a bit complicated. Yeah, yeah, I know. But there's no reason why we couldn't go for a meal still if you. Yeah, yeah, of course. Right, good. <laughs> well, I'll pick you up at 5 30 then. Have a drink first. Sounds good. <laughs> Andrea! What are you doing? Uh, best letter B, eh? Yeah, I just thought. You know, I should apologise. I know. I know. Mm. Going somewhere nice? Uh, just out and about. See, this is where having two kids that can play together is easier than having one. All I've heard off Liam all morning is, I'm bored, I'm bored. And we should get going. Well, if you're stuck, there's a fun fair on. Well, you should take Liam. It's all right. Here we go. Uh, has she lost her manners? I'm sorry. Right, I'll just go get some nibbles. Hey, help. Uh, no. No, you're all right. Oh. Oh, that is a lovely photo. Well, I thought you might be able to get us some up for these. You know, romantic night in or whatever. <laughs> I've got to do a shift of the ones I would say. Mm, thank you. You all right? Yeah, I am. And then I'm, and then I'm not. And it does get easier, you know. Oh, she looks so beautiful. Mm. Yeah, she does, don't she? Mm. 
good look. Is, uh, is Robert in? Sophie wanted me to go into town and get some balloons and that for the auction and bought a wedding dress. I know, I was just walking past the shop and there it was in the window. On sale? Well, yeah, but it was still incredibly expensive. It's virtually designer. Oh, I know. I bought one of mine there. Oh. So come on, what's it like? Oh, girl, it's beautiful. White? Well, ivory. You don't think I'm too... Old? No. I was going to say pale, but... No. Anyway, you can always liven it up with a few flowers, can't you? Listen, I need to get in because Tim's on his round and I, I don't want him to see this. Working on a bank holiday? I am impressed. Well, he's a grafter, you know, deep down. Right, well, I'll see you at the auction then. What if no one else comes? Then I bag you the photo of Lorraine Kelly. Seriously? Oh, go out and come back in, shall I? Well, this looks good. Done a great job here, Soph. My mum's still not here, Dad. Where is she? Hi. Welcome. Hi. 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 Got some great stuff, Sophie. Thanks. And, um, thanks for coming. Why don't I get us a drink? Get a table, I'll go. A bottle of beer, a vodka and tonic, and a bottle of house red. Come on. Sophie, uh, listen, if you want me to leave, I totally understand. If you're looking for me to make you feel better, then... I'm not. I'm really not. I've got things to do. How many glasses for the wine? Just the one. Don't worry. I'll, I'll bring it up. Keep change. Okay. Listen. Shown your face, let's just have a drink and leave, eh? Michelle's right. Just make a donation. Here you go. Well, I'm also gonna get through it. This is going to be fun. You're gonna have to compete with my boyfriend. Right, in my defense. Lorraine Kelly, uh, seriously. Oh, also, can you thank Craig for the painting? Of course. And if he doesn't mind, I'd like to buy it. I think Maddie would have loved it. Mm. Right, just one more minute to blow them cobwebs off those wallets. Woohoo! Um, what's she doing here? Drop it, Tracy. Get myself a tenner, you'd be a no shot. Yeah, well, I sort of am. I only popped in to tell you. Are you kidding that. me? Robert, I don't know what all the fuss is about. So what? You made a plate full of canopies. What? Well, that's what you think I've been doing? Oh, look, of course I'll stay. It's just. It's a bit stressful, you know? Right, same again then. <laughs> that woman needs to get a grip. Well, it can't be easy. Seriously? No answer. Dad, how long does it take to buy blooms? Look, don't stress. Your mum will be here. Right, should we get this show on the road then? <laughs> <laughs> Twenty pounds from Steph. Anybody else? Thirty. Oh, looks like you'll just have to make do with me. Mm. And I found some thirty. Forty. Do you even know who she is? <laughs> Come on, guys. She's the queen of daytime television. Two hundred. Wow. Two hundred. 
You don't have to do this. You can't afford to do this. Sharif? I don't think my wife would understand. Okay, well, if everyone's done... Sold for 200 pounds. That better not be the petty cash. Congratulations. It wasn't gonna hurt, didn't I? She's still a bit woozy from the anaesthetic. I feel like I held my breath the whole time she was in there. She's a brave little girl, ain't she, Ruby, eh? Yeah, I just can't wait to get her home now. Apart from anything else, I'm tired and starving. Just a few more minutes, all right, and then we'll go. Just sit still, will you, Ruby? One more minutes and we'll go for a walk, okay? I'm sorry. Sorry, Ruby. Hey, why don't you play with Dolly? Yeah? Hi, how are we all doing in here? Hello, ho. Remember me? Everything went well with the MRI. Did you do some more observations and then you can go? And when will we get the results? Couple of days. Back in a tick. Hasn't she been through enough? When she was a baby, the hole in her heart. I thought we were done with hospitals. This. She's a fighter, aren't you, darling, eh? OK, would anyone like to offer me £50 for this lovely signed Weatherfield County shirt? 50 I mean, I love Kirky, but... Oh. 50 You don't even like football. It's a good cause. 55 60 65 75 85. 95. OK, well, if there's no more, we're going to have to let it go on 95 pounds. Going once, going twice. 150. Ooh, that is more like it. Any advance on 150 pounds? 170. <laughs> 250. <laughs> Any advance on 250? You're all done. Going once, going twice, sold. Hey, I never knew you were a county fan. I'm not. Excuse me. I wonder why they like my best. Cheers. Hey, how do you like this? Thank you. Carla. Carla. Well, I know what you're going through. Mm. Really, I do. You shouldn't be here. Yeah. Come on. Oh, uh, now, just leave her, all right? Why did you let her come here? Carla, you can't keep doing this to yourself. Come on, let's go. There, huh? To be honest, though, I thought it'd be stiffer competition. Yeah, but then, uh, well, he's not a county fan, is he? <laughs> Where are you going? Ah! Whoa! Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, dancer, let's take a seat. Yeah. <laughs> She's had enough. Yeah, you're telling me. Mm. Pretty pathetic, really. Oi, cut us some slack, okay? Don't you think she's been cutting off slack? She's still walking, which is more than can be said for Maddie and Cal.
What do you think you play? Not a word. <laughs> On the house. Well, that's unusually generous of you, landlord. Well, it's got to be worth a couple of quid, hasn't it? Seeing a smile on my mother's face again. Not sure that's down to me, but, um, Jean? Whoever's buying vodka and coat large. It was your shack, wasn't it? Yeah, that one. So, that was, um, Jason. He's alive. Oh. Cheers. Welcome. Do you know I've got your ex name with me? Saw her coming out this morning. Mm, I have to say, I'm starting to feel a bit sorry for her, even though she did bring it on herself. And you were right to break up with her. And now you're moving on. You are moving on. What, yeah? Because if you're not, do not be leading Liz up the garden path. I'm not. She's your best mate, Lloyd. Be warned. Cheers. <laughs> Come on now. I don't want to go. Where's her bag? Oh, oh. earlier. Look, just take her, will you? Because she's upsetting everybody. I just want a drink. What's wrong? What? What do you think is wrong? Look at her. She thinks she killed Maddie and Cal. It was in the loo. Oh, cheers. OK. Now, are you going to be OK? Right. Come on, lady, let's get you old. Sophie. Sophie, I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. Where's that now? She's gone, right? I'm going. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, nice and easy. Come on now. Come on now. We go. Okay then, Pastor, it is. Do you want some more? I can do an omelette or something. It's hard, but there's no point in worrying until we know what's what. So we get the results and then. I know. I know. The important thing is that Hope doesn't get scared. You know, we just carry on as normal. Try and make life as much fun as we can. Do whatever we can to make her happy. But while this is boiling, I'm just going to nip and go and get some milk. I'll go. No, it's no problem. I've still got my coat on. You've had enough to drink. Ah, uh, you don't get to decide that because you see, if you're not on my side, you can just shift out. Okay, okay. You can kick off all you like. And as for being on your side, why do you think we're here? Because it sure ain't for the fun of it. This isn't gonna have much you push. I'm going nowhere. Come on. I think folk round here have had enough entertainment for one day. Come on, then. Come on. One foot in front of the other. Come on. It's stuck. I know it's stuck. It's jammed on some material. I think I'm going to have to rip it. Hey, this is my wedding dress. I don't want it ruined. Just ease it down a little bit. Yeah, well, that's what I'm doing. It's just not budging. Well, just move the material out of the way of the zip. Oh, yeah. Easier said than done. What are you doing dressing up in the first place? Hey, I don't just whip this out, you know. Every time I get a bit bored, I bought it earlier on and just wanted to try it on. What was I doing? Prancing around the room, was you? None of your <laughs> business. Well, it is my business now, I reckon. Tim! Me, your daughter, remember. You're right. 
Did you have a nice day out in the end then? Um, no, not really. Not Sometimes best laid plans, eh? All right, fine. I'm sorry. What's up? Is it you and Tyrone? Have you had a row or something? Hey, come on, Fizz. It can't be that bad. It's hope. Why? What's happened? What's going on? Look, I told you I didn't want to go. No, I'm talking about you and Carla. Nothing. Well, she was getting on my nerves. So why were you being nice to her? I wasn't. Anyway, I'm not a total cow. The woman killed people, Tracy. You said it yourself a hundred times. I don't want to talk about the fire, OK? It's not the fire. That's not it. That's not what got you upset. My daughter nearly died. Don't treat me like an idiot. Amy's fine. She's dealt with it. It's not the fire that upset you. It's Carla. <laughs> what is it you're not telling me? Well, we're back in Coronation Street in half an hour.